is a grade A, or maybe not. So this capacity maybe is a grade B level, or grade C, or anything we don't know. Hello guys, welcome back to Lia's channel again. In my previous video, I show you guys the new model on the market, big capacity EVE 628 mph battery cells. One piece battery can reach to 2 kWh battery cells. It means you only need two more smaller battery box and use the fewer connecting wires and fewer screws to combine a system, which is a very huge attraction for some guys who want to pursue the more simply and the more efficiency solar system. We have been testing the EVE MB56. 628 mph cells in the last two months because we think we need to take so much time to test the new model on the market we need to check the battery cells the self discharge rates and the capacity and the all the consistency when we do the aging test in previous our company buy a very small battery brand the nominal capacity is 100 mph battery cells. And then we do the aging test for this small brand battery cells, 100 mph cells. When we're doing the first cycle test, the capacity still can reach 100 mph above. But when we're doing the five test, the capacity already down the 95 mph only. And after we do the test again up to the 10, the capacity even only 90 mph. So this was a very shocking rate of a battery decline. And in most of cases, a brand new and the quality standard listen iron battery cells will show negligible capacity degradation after 10 charge and discharge cycles under normal usage, typically less than 0.5%, even completely undetectable. Okay, in this video, they also have another big capacity, also new model on the battery markets. Curtail CATL brand 530 mph cells. In this video, I will to show you guys the 530 mph, 628 mph, and the REPT 314, EVE 314. I will show you the difference and to analyze the details from appearance and the fake or real QR code and the size and the price and our suggestions for you guys. Okay, let's be to start it. Okay, first one is the EV628 mph. We can to check the QR code. This is also original. It is from the EV manufacturer and never reprinted QR code now. And the you can check the terminal of EV brand. They also use the design, no matter for other capacity it is. And the QR code, it, it touch very smoothly. And also go for the curtail. Curtail 530 mph. This battery cells we department got from the markets and the seller who provided the curtail uh, 530 mp hours. They told us this is curtail, but uh, I still have a little confused because first, as you all as you all know, in my previous video, I told you guys the curtail battery grade A is very hard to got it, and uh, the QR code they always reprinted the QR code and to erase all the QR code because the CATL, they want to protect their brand. But this curtail 530 mph, this QR code, it touched very rough and, uh, and this QR code is, looks very fake 
and the other way we erased the battery black cover you can see they have a trace of reprinted QR code so so this is not good for this uh, for at this moment let's we to check the size size of the 628 you can very easily to check it will like to combine with two pieces two pieces 314 mph hour cells the length of mb56 is uh, 352 millimeter the height is 204 millimeter and the thickness is uh, 72 millimeter and for the curtail curtail the size Let's read to check. It will mean it will be more shorter than the MB56. The length is uh, 274 millimeter. The height is 210 millimeter. Thickness is the same, 72 millimeter. Okay, the next important part is the capacity test. In my last video. I mentioned one important point for the DIY beginner. No matter which great battery you bought, no matter which brand you bought, and no matter the supplier told you which capacity they have, you always need to do the capacity aging test. The EVE MB56 628 mph, we already do the cycling, cycling test. The real capacity for the first time is 680 mph. Actually, this is a very perfect capacity because it is already over 52 mph than the nominal capacity. And as we all know, most of the grade A battery cells, they will all over more capacity. Like the Metro Item EVE 314 mph and the REPT 314 mph. The EVE model, the real capacity, or we already tested, it can reach 330 mph. And the REPT model we test can reach 336 mph around. And we don't only to test one piece, we test these two models from 1000 pieces. They all the similar capacity range. So it can show this batch of these two models is very good consistency. But for the curtail 500, and 30 mph this model we test under the voltage range 2.5 voltage to 3.65 voltage and under the 30 current the real capacity only have 537 mph this is a little lower capacity if it is a grade a or maybe not this capacity maybe is a grade B level or grade C or anything we don't know. So actually for the curtail, the markets don't have grade A cells. And the EVE 314 mph price now on markets is $55. And the REPT model 314 mph is $45 around. At the same time, our factory still are doing the aging test for the EVE MB56 628 mph cells. It will take so much time. So for now, many customers ask, our, ask ourselves, Leah, can you provide me the big capacity? And uh, what do you think of this new model, big capacity? Actually, we still don't know, and because we waiting the test results, and uh, because we need to take so much time, maybe one month or three months, we need to do a multiply charge and the discharging for the new model, similar to you guys how you use it at your home. We need to determine how much capacity remains after one or two months of use, and whether it. Uh, and whether the self-discharge and the stability 
are suitable for our customers or not. Okay, if you guys are interested in our factory test results for the EV MB56 628 mph cells, I will update the video for our test results after we finished. If you are interested, please follow my channel and I will also share a lot of uh, buying guides of battery and other battery knowledge on my channel. Okay, thanks for your watching. See you next time. Bye bye.